Okay. The best quality of any sports. Tell me on y'all level. Not telling my understanding. Y'all level. I said an OV, but anyway. Seeing, interpreting, reacting. Heck, that's for anything in my life. It's like meeting. You see the words, you interpret the words, you react to the words. Basically, you retaining it and ability to apply the memory of it. Any sports. Some people reaction time are pretty fast. Y'all standard for y'all fastest time is like 1.1 second. Uh, 1.2 seconds. I know people say 0.9. Don't really believe it. I'll time you myself, and I know it's not 0.9. Heck, people shoot tennis ball from records and catch it to instantly come out. It is not 0. Points, wherever that is, wherever second that is. Y'all standards 1.1 second. Don't worry about my standards. The ability to um, get it in your head, interpret what it is, and react to it. Not this thing, the interpreter is thinking what you need to do, and reacting is actually reacting. It's not that difficult, people. Um, the reason why I want to say this, some of the stuff y'all do is that my standard because y'all plan for it. Like having people shoot tennis ball right in front of me. You put where the tennis ball is going, you know when the tennis ball is coming, and you catching it. Great ability, people. Nice planning. See how that goes when I shoot tennis bar to you. See how fast your reaction time, your interpret time, your getting your head time. The only thing you know is I'm shooting tennis bar at you. Yeah, you might not even know I'm shooting tennis bar. Let's see how are you getting that. Ha. I'm very good. Don't worry. That's right, people. I do airsoft and paintball wars. People see me coming out of nowhere. Heck. I mean, while I was deployed doing et cetera, et cetera, we had people hiding in freaking carpets. They're almost on my level. Heck, almost now my level. I might walk through the walls and get you. Don't even worry about it. Fun game. Read it, understand it, interpret it, and react. Any sport. Football, basketball, hockey, working. Heck, if you're doing a physical working, you carrying sheetrock or gypsy. Or, what's that other stuff? ICF? Don't know. Have another round. You see this rock, you actually interpret, you figure out how to pick it up, you pick it up, and as you put it on the wall, it's about to drop. What are you going to do? That little section thing may cost $200. Not only did it break or the person you carry break, you are the one to be blamed for it. Of course, if it was me, we're going to do a fight for it. Like, if you lose, you have to pay for it, but that's just me. Anyway. That's just for you guys. Anyway, have fun. Do not consider those three things when you plan for it out. If you plan, like if you know it's coming and planning for it to happen, it is not on a standard, on my standard. You should be happening. It should be something surprise. It should be a surprise, people, and you actually react the time to getting out of it. Don't say, oh, my stuff is a fast reaction. But don't even worry about it. If I punch you if I punch you in the other people way, you have less chance to see it coming, but you have more chance to see it coming if I punch you in my way. If I punch you my way, you might die and they answer that hit you. Believe me, I know how to hit people. Heck, I punch freaking trees when I want to, when I can, but don't worry. Anyway, those three things. Seeing it, interpreting, and reacting for any support, all physical support, any physical demands. Alright, move on to my reflex and instinct videos. Did that be it for today?